while solving a trigonometric inequality with TI-8384 brand of graphing calculators in the radian mode, what we will do is, we will have an equation of the form f of x is less than, less than g of x, or f of x is greater than g of x, or less than or equal to, or greater than or equal to. It is very simple, but it has two major differences from other kinds of inequalities. We have to make sure that we are given in the right mode for the angle mode. For instance, we have to be we have to decide whether we are in the radian mode or the degree mode. And the second thing to note is we have to make sure that the lower and upper bounds for our screen, for our window, is correct. Meaning that the x min and x max have to be set correctly. Now let us say we have an inequality of this form. We would like to find the value of values of x for which sine 2x is greater than sine x and x lies between 0 and 2 pi. We will get the right hand side to the left. We will sketch the graph. We will, we will find the values of x for which y is positive. We have to make sure that we are in the radian mode and that the x min value is 0 and x max value is 2 pi. First, we enter the function as sine 2x minus sine x. Then we make sure that we are in the correct mode. We are in the radian mode, so we don't need to make any changes. And third, we have to, we have to make sure that the x min and x max values are correct. The x min value must be 0, and x max value must be 2 pi. And we sketch the graph. We will find the set of x values for which the expression was positive. Now this is 0. This is 2 pi. And this is right in between. This is the middle. So it is pi. So what we really need to do is calculate these two values of these two values only we will calculate the x intercept with calculate zero The first x-intercept is 1.047. Actually, 3 times this value equals pi. So this is nothing but pi over 3. The second x-intercept is 5.24. And we see that the graph is symmetrical about this point. Therefore, this value is nothing but 2 pi minus pi over 3, because the distance here is the same as this distance. 
Now, if we go back to our original question, we have found that the x-intercepts are 0 pi over 3 pi, 5 pi over 3, and 2 pi. And the solution set is x is between 0 and 1.05, or x is between 3.14 and 5.24. Please notice the highlighted portions. There are a few things to note in here. Or, he notes that it's a union operation. Our solution set contains both of these intervals. And we also make sure that in the original equation, the x-intercepts were not required. Therefore, none of these boundaries are included in the solution set. Today, we will be solving a trigonometric inequality with the TI-8384 graphing calculators in the degree mode. Let us imagine that we are given such an inequality. We are required to find the values of x for which cosine 2x is greater than or equal to cosine x, and x is between 0 and 360 degrees inclusive. What we will do is we will sketch the graph of cosine 2x minus cosine x, and then we will find the set of x values for which this expression is greater than or equal to 0. We will find the set of x values that the graph lies above the x-axis or the graph intersects the x-axis. First, we enter the function as cosine 2x minus cosine x. And then we make sure that the angle mode is in degrees. Then we go back to our window settings. And we set x min as 0, x max at 360 degrees and x scale is 90 because we want four grids displayed on the screen. Next, we will find the x-intercepts. We know that this x-intercept is 0 and this x-intercept is 2 pi. So we are left with finding these two x-intercepts. The first x-intercept is 120 degrees. For the second x-intercept, I would like to enter the left bound and right bound using the keyboard. The left bound is 180 degrees, obviously. The right bound is 270 degrees. And the second x-intercept is 240 degrees. Going back to our original question. We have found that the set of x values for which that expression is positive or 0 include 0, 2 pi, 
and all of these highlighted portions. So our solution set is all x values between 120 degrees and 240 degrees inclusive, as well as 0 degrees and 360 degrees. The things to note in this problem was we have to make sure that we select the correct angle mode. In this case, it was the degree mode. And we also have to make sure that the x min and x max values are set correctly. For this particular example, they were given as 0 degrees and 360 degrees. 